Yeah, I mean, and I know this is another big question we get a yeah. lot. Is that people are like, do, I, mean, I remember so many times CF saying, well, do you just tell me where I'm going to go? It's like, no, why would you? I get that's that a lot. Good. I get yes. that a lot too. Yeah, it's like, oh, guess where you're going? Behind yeah. door number one <laughs> is where, yeah, exactly. <laughs> um, yeah, choose your own adventure. Yeah. <laughs> um, no, it's not like that at all. And one more thing too I want to add that I think it's important just back to the contractor piece is that I think sometimes people don't realize that as a contractor and not a 1099, but a contractor, like I said, for working with med travelers, Mm -hmm. is that you still have all the same benefits that you would if you were a permanent employee. So let's say you go right to the school district as a permanent employee, you interview, you get hired, um, they're going to take care of your salary, they're going to take care of your benefits, they may, may... have some sort of retirement package, all of that's going to be provided. As a contractor, you still have those same perks. So for example, with us, you would still have all your benefits. You would have retirement. So all those same benefits that you would have with the school, you would have with us as your employer. So I just wanted to add that because I think that's another where people think, oh, I'm going to have to buy my own insurance. And no, yeah, you no, that's won't. Yeah, very important. I'm glad you brought that up too. Yeah. But then going back to... What does it look like? So it really is more of a conversation about where is it you want to go? What is it you want to do? And is it you've always known you wanted to go to this location and do this? Or is it, you know, I would be open to anywhere that's like in the Pacific Northwest. What are those options? And it really is listening to what it is you want, what's important to you, and then finding a job that fits what you want and what's important to you. So if you say, I want to go to the Pacific Northwest, um, you're not going to end up in um, North Carolina. (laughs) So (laughs) you really do get to say where it is you want to go, what you want to do. And again, it doesn't mean that, you know, your first choice and everything you want is going to be available. Oftentimes Mm -hmm. it is, but, um, but at least somewhere in that general area, I would say we could get you. Yeah. Or you can no. work as in to complete your CF. Yeah. I think it's important to know that you're a part of that process too. I think it can be kind of overwhelming or scary to think like, okay, I'm going to start this process. I'm fully committed. I'm doing all of this. I'm going to just, you know, have to take whatever and being, you know, aware that you are a part of that whole process and getting to pick and choose like Pacific Northwest, which is great, or East Coast and seeing options there. Mm-hmm. 